Stardew Valley on the Switch? Is Player Unknown Backgrounds becoming the latest victim of review bombing? Let's find out on Impractical Daily. The popular farming sim game Stardew Valley has a release date for the Nintendo Switch, and it's coming out much sooner than we all expected. The game will launch on the Switch eShop on the day of this year's Harvest Moon, October 5th, just two days away. It is expected to retail at around $15, and even though the game is already on PS4 and Xbox One, the Switch version will be the first to receive the game's multiplayer update. 2K Sports are giving us more information about how WWE 2K18's character customization and progression system will work in the game. The My Player system will allow you to customize the appearance, weight class, moves, and taunts of your wrestler while also choosing a fighting style ranging from speed and agility like High Flyer to more power based styles like Powerhouse. There will also be loot crates to unlock special items, the ability to boost attributes, and so much more, so it looks like this year's game has a lot more to offer. Player Unknown Backgrounds is the latest game subject to review bombing due to adverts being shown in the Chinese market. Steam's new histogram format to help identify review bombings showed over 20,000 negative reviews for the game in just the past couple of days. This isn't the first time Backgrounds has showed sponsored content on their homepage, however the histogram format is a very public way of showing dislike for a game, so it's unclear how this is actually helping review bombing at all. Little Story of the developers of Unsung Story announced that the Nintendo Switch, Xbox One and PS4 versions are in the works. The game was originally funded on Kickstarter in 2014 to bring it to mobile devices, however the original developers Playdeck target PC platforms as well as consoles and struggle to meet pledge goals. It's great the game is finally getting back on track and hopefully the console versions will come out very soon. That's it for Impractical Daily, subscribe if you're new and I'll see you tomorrow.